I know you had a mixed drink before, but have you had a cocktail? Let's talk about that. Welcome to these cocktails. And today, we're doing red ruby to sleeves. We're going to get started with a half ounce of egg white. Three quarter ounces of a red grapefruit juice. Fresh if possible. Three quarter ounces of lemon juice. Three quarter ounces of an elderflower liqueur. We're using St. Germain. A half ounce of a red aperitivo. We're using Aperol. Aperol is a herbal liqueur, grapefruit, things of that nature. One and a half ounces of a vodka. We're using St. Augustine. It's a Florida cane vodka. Locally made. If you guys haven't been to St. Augustine, it's a wonderful place. You guys should check it out. We're going to add ice, give it a shake, one over top. Nice hard shake. So I did forget to dry shake because it does have egg white. So we're going to do a little experiment. We're going to reverse dry shake it. Some of you guys have never seen me do it before. It won't impact the flavor of the cocktail. It's more of a texture thing. We're actually going to do a video on that. I won't spoil it. I won't go any further with talk, but we're going to do a video on that. You guys are going to enjoy it. So we're going to strain the ice out back into the tin, dump the ice, and then shake the cocktail again. Reverse dry shake. We're going to serve this in a chilled coop. Chilled coop. Hawthorne strainer. Fine mess. In the words of Bob Ross, there's no such thing as mistakes, just happy accidents. We're going to garnish this with a grapefruit twist. There you have it. Red Ruby to Sleeves. Cheers. A very grapefruit forward cocktail you do get the elderflower and you get lots of vodka this is a good cocktail it's very refreshing and i will say the texture of the egg white is a lot different than what i'm used to but you guys will find out real soon you want to try it a lighter it's not as like velvety thick yeah i would like to try it the other way too we'll let you guys know how it turns out but it is very floral it's grapefruit, so it's very sour. And overall, it's a bitter cocktail, but it's very delicious. You guys are going to enjoy this one. Cheers.